What's going on everybody, Trico here back with another video and what we have is the start of a new series I am doing, Road to Completionist. I think that's what it's called so I'm going to go with it. Either I'm doing Road to Completionist or Road to All 99's. Uh, completionist sounds cool and a lot of people do it so I'm going to start with this episode. As you can see my skills here in the right, I don't have a single 99 so what I'm going to be doing is going to get those 99s, doing the quests, and doing like all the little tasks that you have to do throughout the world of Gilinor. So once I get to about 15, 20 clips, I'm going to be putting them all into one episode. So right here you see I just got 70 runecrafting, and I'll be showing you every single level that I get throughout the skills. I might start doing it every like 5 levels, like the milestones, and I'm also going to show you the treasure hunter stuff that I get from the keys, and some little things like this. Right here I am collecting the honeybee hives. I think that's what they are. And they sell for quite a bit of money since it was right before double XP. So I kind of knew something that would sell before double XP so I could get a little bit of a cash before that. So I'm still kind of a noob at this game. But these are some of the things I do to make a little bit of a money on the side. I'm always live streaming when I play this game, so you can come check out uh, everything that's going on live and just chat about what I'm doing. And right here, I'm doing a quest. Let's see what quest this was. Soul's Bane, that's a quest I just did. And I'm trying to do all these small quests first because I'm really wanting to unlock Prith. I have never been there before, and there's a lot of places I've never been. I haven't done any bosses. I've only done like the King Black Dragon, and then I've done the Giant Mole. And right here you see I got 78 smithing, and then over here I get 70 fire making, 77 fire making. But anyways, I want to unlock all the things I haven't been able to do. I haven't done God Wars, God Wars 2, um, the new, what is it, World Wakes, I think, is that what it was? I don't really sure what they just put in the game. And there's some other new quests that come out that I can't do because I don't have the requirements. So I'm going to be trying to do all the quests and unlock the other ones. And, oh, big tip right here in this part, um, go to World 2 at least once whenever you're playing, like each day. Try to go to World 2 and go to Birth Rope and just go on all these divination spots. Everybody is just throwing them down and it can really help you get a lot of levels quick. So that's what I usually do. I don't know what I'm doing right there. Reporting someone for someone. And then I went over and did some more quests. I did about two or three. One, I didn't like record the clip of me getting the badge. It was that one where you're flying the um, the balloon or something like that. It was really kind of confusing at first. And then this quest right here took forever. Um, I forgot how it was something, something rising. I forgot the name. And then you get some treasure stuff. But I wasn't able to get all the extra stuff from it because I didn't have some quests done. So what I'm trying to do is just complete all the quests so I can unlock a lot of the stuff I haven't been able to get. And then we ran over to the desert and did the Spear of the Elid quest. And I think you get one or two treasure keys every quest you do. So I always unlock uh, the treasure keys or use the treasure keys after every single quest or when I'm doing a daily challenge. Those come in handy a lot when it comes to boosting your skills. And then I did some wood cutting. I went over here to Yenville and cut down some ivies for like a couple hours and then got my wood cutting all the way up to level 90. I think this is going to be my first 99. Um, it's almost 91 right now. It has 22,000 XP left. Thanks to double XP helping me out a little bit. I've been able to boost my skills up a lot and you'll be seeing my gains after double XP. And episode 2 will probably be covering everything from double XP weekend. I think it's just the weekend or maybe it's the week. And then we ran back to birth rope and did some skilling because you get the little boosts while you're there. They have the they have the pulse cores that people use whenever they're there that actually helps out a lot. Every time I go to do like a skill where you're just sitting there, I always go to world two and do it there because of all the boosts you can uh, get a lot of XP a lot faster. Last we did the missing my mummy quest. So that's gonna be it for episode one of Road to Completionist. I hope you guys do enjoy this episode and there's gonna be a lot of tips, how to's, and other videos coming out. So just stick tuned and wait for episode two. Hopefully you guys like what I'm doing 
And if you want to see me in game, I'm usually on world 85, 14, or 27. And my name is Trico RS. So come play with me, I guess. And you can just add me to your friends list or join my clan if you want. But anyways, I'll see you guys on the next video. This was Trico YT. See you later.